Semiconductor manufacturing, often referred to as semiconductor fabrication or semiconductor lithography, is the intricate process of creating integrated circuits, ICs, or microchips that form the backbone of modern electronic devices. Here's a simplified overview of how semiconductor manufacturing works. 1. Design and mass creation. The process begins with the design of the integrated circuit using computer-aided design, CAD, tools. Once the design is finalized, a photo mask is created. This mask defines the pattern that will be transferred onto the silicon wafer during manufacturing. 2. Silicon wafer preparation. Silicon wafers, typically 12 inches, 300 millimeters, in diameter, are thoroughly cleaned and polished to remove any impurities and defects. These wafers serve as the base material for the chips. 3. Photolithography. Photolithography is a critical step where the photomask pattern is transferred onto the silicon wafer. Ultraviolet, UV, light is shown through the mask, projecting the pattern onto a layer of photoresist material applied to the wafer. The exposed photoresist becomes either more or less soluble, depending on the type, positive or negative, and is then chemically developed, leaving the desired pattern on the wafer. 4. Etching. After photolithography, Various etching processes are used to remove excess material from the wafer. Dry etching, wet etching, or plasma etching techniques are employed to precisely shape the semiconductor materials. 5. Implantation. Ion implantation is used to introduce dew pants, impurities, into the silicon to modify its electrical properties, creating N-type, electron-rich, and P-type, hole-rich, regions that form transistors and other electronic components. 6. Deposition. Thin films of materials like silicon dioxide, CO2, or metal are deposited onto the wafer through techniques like chemical vapor deposition, CVD, or physical vapor deposition, PVD. These films serve as insulators, conductors, or other functional layers. 7. Chemical mechanical polishing, CMP. CMP is used to flatten and planarize the wafer surface ensuring uniformity for subsequent layers. 8. Annealing. Heat treatment is performed to activate dew pants, heal defects, and optimize the electrical properties of the silicon. 9. Lithography and repeat. Steps 3 through 8 are repeated multiple times to build up the intricate layers and patterns required for the specific IC design. 10. Packaging. Once all the layers and components are in place, the individual chips are separated from the wafer and packaged in protective enclosures, often with input-output pins for connection to external devices. 11. Testing and quality control. Each chip undergoes rigorous testing to ensure functionality and performance meet specifications. Semiconductor manufacturing is a highly precise and complex process, involving advanced equipment and cleanroom environments to prevent contamination. It demands continuous innovation and investment in technology to keep up with the shrinking sizes and increasing complexity of modern semiconductor devices. Subscribe for more videos. Thanks for watching.